Hello and welcome to another video. This will be another app on my street recap. Oh wow. Um and this one is going to be episode twelve. This uh the episode name is Skipping School and this is part of the another multi part thing that's going on in Phoenix Drop Season One called Jean's Scheme. This one's part two to that. Part one. That was the last one I had I did. So Oh, wow, this is uploaded just a couple months before I start watching McChagan, I guess. So, yeah, episode 12. Let's see what happens in this video. Or episode, I should say. <sighs> Leave me alone. Oh, come on. You still can't be mad at me. Think about it this way. Isn't Kitty a cuter nickname than Potato? They're both bad, and I don't appreciate either. Aw, it just means that people have a... I mean, Kitty isn't the worst nickname ever, but I get why Akma finds the Potato one offensive, though. I, I can totally get that. Although, I can see why Akma in this season uh, doesn't like the Kitty nickname, though, because uh, you know it's Jean, and Jean's a bully, so... Not a full, full on bully, but enough to be considered as one. I mean, I've seen shows, TV shows, even real life um, examples where there's more bully oriented uh, signs and stuff like that. So, but now Jane is definitely considered a bully. Um, I wouldn't be concerned him as that if he wasn't black male and half male here, but he is. So, yeah. Anyways, uh, let's, uh, let's continue this. Special affection for you. So, you like me? Nah, not one bit. I just like toying with people, and you, Missy, set yourself up to be the perfect target. How? Hmm, let's see. Well, first off, you got caught up with Lawrence and Garth. <laughs> oh, and how lucky am I that... They both ended up liking you. It's the perfect formula to not only toy with you, but I get the pleasure of seeing them go at each other if one of them finds out. Second, Ivy hates your guts. So if she saw this picture of you kissing her man, well, I'd hate to think what she'd do. <gasps> How do you know about Ivy? The walls have ears, my dear kitty. Oh, but not only that. You turned out to be a feisty one. Seeing how you dealt with that Aaron guy, which means you're going to be a fun one to have in my gang. I already told you I'm not joining, and you can't force me. Oh, I'm not going to force you. You're going to join on your own. <laughs> yeah, right. That's the bell. Come on, let's go. To class? Because that sounds like a great plan. <laughs> nope, no, we're skipping school today. What? You heard me. Let's go. No way. Go get your little lackeys to skip with you. Sasha and Zenites are always waiting for us outside of school. Huh? <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> You're the only one I know who can look at that guy in the eye. You're tougher than you look. Now follow me. If not, I'll just text this picture to Lawrence. I'm sure he'll love to see it. It will get him motivated for his upcoming game for sure. to know Sasha Zenix and myself better. Then we're going to go out for coffee later. You drink coffee? 
Straight black. Like my soul. Ugh, that sounds appropriate. Come on, relax. You're chilling with the cool kids now. Cool kids? Don't you mean bad? You're skipping class. How is this cool? Look, I'll make you a deal. If you don't like us by the end of this skipping session, I promise I'll never ask you to skip class again. You promise? Promise? I just want you to get to know us outside of what rumors you've heard. We're not really all that bad. <sighs> Fine. Deal. Great. Speaking of which... Sasha! Zenix! We're here. Can you yell any louder, Jean? Mother of Irene, I was about to take a nap. Shut up, Xenix. You took forever, Jean. I brought our little pet with me. No way. You actually got her to skip? With a little help from our picture, of course. Now you two make her feel welcome. I want her to get to know us. See, we're not such bad people. After all, she's going to be joining our little group here soon. What? Really? She said yes? Not yet. But you guys know I'm not one to force a good thing. She's going to join of her own choice. But first, she's got to get to know us. Ah, I see. She can't. I bet she's not even hardcore enough. Shut up, Xenix. <laughs> I swear, Xenix has the same temper as that Zane kid. Speaking of which, why don't we let him into our little group? Why are we stuck with this lame kitten here? Stop calling me that! <sighs> Zane's a poser. Plus, he's no fun to play with. He was so eager to join our group that it made him look pathetic. Give him a month or two to see how he does on his own. And then, maybe, I'll think about it. Huh? Make him work for it, huh? What's the point in having a super exclusive group if we just let any emo kid join? We're not emo kids, Jean. I'm not talking about us. I'm talking about Zane. Whoops. Sorry. I misunderstood. Anyway, I'm gonna go get the stuff. You make Kitty here feel at home. I won't be long. Huh? All right. Just hurry up. Wait! What stuff is he getting? Stuff for our art. You'll see. Uh, uh, I don't think I like the sound of that. So, what kind of grades do you get? Huh? huh? Are you a straight-A student? Average? Dumb? Uh, well, so far, I usually got all A's and some B's. And if it's a subject... I'm terrible in, like, math. Uh, usually, like, a, a C-plus or something. Hmm. Well, good to know we aren't letting someone in who gets bad grades. Huh? Y you mean y you guys don't? Nah. But you skip class almost every day. Yeah. So I don't get how that works. We get bad grades because we miss class and tend not to listen to the teacher. So that obviously reflects on our records. It's an attempt for the man to control us with these letters that we find such validation in. Huh? Wow. That's, um... <laughs> uh, that's really a mouthful. Just words, sweetheart. Honestly... Jean, Zenix, and I are very smart when it comes to our studies. We're just bored because nothing challenges us in academics anymore. Hence why we skip class. If I'm going to be bored, I don't want to be bored in that building we call school. I see. Well, 
That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> eh? I mean... Like... I mean... If nothing else challenges you, then why don't you find ways to challenge yourself? Like, maybe go the extra mile and try to write up a report on how you can improve the processes our teachers go about? Or maybe find a way they can challenge you. I mean, think about it this way. Our teachers are students in a way, too. They have to deal with students of all kinds of personalities. Maybe some smarter than others. If you were really bored and wanted to find more ways to challenge yourself, then why don't you find ways to teach those who need help teaching you? I think I see why Jean took an interest in you. Hmm? Uh. Come here. Give me your hand. Huh? Well, what are you going to do? I like to do palm readings. Just a small little hobby I'm into. Huh? You aren't going to do anything weird to my hand, are you? Just give me your stupid hand. Huh? Mm, okay. Let's see. Lots of creativity. A whole lot, actually. Hmm. Apparently you're pretty open about your emotions and feelings. Which is a total lie, obviously. Or you wouldn't even be here in the first place. Huh? And then... Short and shallow. That's weird because your fate line conflicts with... Hmm. Interesting. Hmm. Stop hmm. holding her hand, Sasha! Stop being emo, ZX! Don't tell me how to live my life! According to your palm, your life is pretty dull. I don't need a fake palm reader who learned all her lessons from the internet to tell me how to live my life! <sighs> just ignore Xenix. Now he's just yelling to yell. I like yelling! I like when you shut up! Come make me! Kitty, be a dear and go make Xenix be quiet for me. I want to take a nap before Jean makes you do the initiation thingy. Huh? Wait, what initiation thingy? I, I, hey, hey, wake up! Uh, are you serious? What? Uh, uh, initiation? I haven't even agreed to join this little group. I need to know what this is. Maybe I'll ask Zenix. Uh, Phoenix? Mm. Uh, what do you want? Sasha already got you to do her dirty work? <laughs> of course you'd listen to her. No, 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 she, she took a nap. I actually just wanted to ask you about this initiation that Sasha had said about Jean making me do or something like that. <laughs> I'm not going to spoil the surprise. Just know that if you do it, you'll be super hardcore in my book. Huh? Skipping classes and hardcore enough? Meh, it's okay. It's not hard to skip class. Yeah, I've done that before. I'm not but why are you so angry? Why are you so happy? Because it's better than being angry? Says who? Says me? Well, aren't you important then? You're too. Says who? Says me! Well, looks like you're getting to know our group a little more. She's being weird. <laughs> we like weird, don't we? Sure, I guess. F now, follow me. Well, what do you think of our little group? Uh, you guys seem okay, but I'm not interested at all in joining. I just want to finish this day of skipping school and leave. All right. You know what? I'll let you go. And delete the picture? Who said anything about deleting the picture? I'm going to keep it. I just said I wasn't going to make you skip school with it again. That's all. Uh, you? Uh, 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 uh. Now, now. Don't get too worked up. You'll have one more thing to do before I let you go. What's that? 
Tag this wall with the Shadow Knight logo. What? <laughs> you heard me. I want you to vandalize this wall. There is no way I'm doing that. I'm not a criminal. <laughs> you're a criminal as long as you're mine. No! Hmm. Well then, I wonder what Lawrence is up to right now. Wait! No! If I do this, does that mean I'm a part of your group? Nope. You're just doing the work of tagging this place for me. Plus, if you do this one time, I'll never ask you to tag this place for me again. Uh, fine. Deal. Perfect. Now get to work. Not bad. Looks great. Maybe you're hardcore enough after all. You're free to go home now, kitty. We're headed to the coffee shop if you want to join us. No thanks. Suit yourself. Come on, guys, let's go. kids who've been tagging this place with that logo. Wait! That's not how this happened! I didn't... Save it! The criminal always returns to the scene of the crime. Come on, you're coming with me, toots. Concludes that episode. That was an interesting episode with that. Um, it was mainly Afmal, Gene, Zenix, and Sasha that we saw in this one. We didn't really see anyone else. We saw Aaron a little bit, but not that much. So, <clears throat> but yeah, interesting episode there. Uh, I'll be doing the next part to this in episode 13 tomorrow. So stay tuned for that. <laughs> 